fantastic game here at Oregon State. one nothing. Stanford wins in 10 innings despite Cooper Jerpy, the nation's leader in wins with six coming in. He had won all six of his starts this year. Jerpy ended up with 17 strikeouts, tying a school record there. He struck out Brock Jones. That was starting off the ball game. Meanwhile, Alex Williams, uh, Stanford, he did a nice job as well with six and a third innings. And then Jerpy back to work. A couple more Ks. There's a strikeout of Greg Fuchs to leave a runner at second in the fourth inning by Williams. Jerpy again. More strikeouts. Really had the slider work and starting with the second time through the order. Happy about that one for sure. Mason Smith struck out 17 back in 1994, and Cooper Jerby tied the school record. Here there's a base hit to right by Kyle Dernetti in a scoreless game in the bottom of the seventh inning. You see it here, and Greg Fuchs coming home. Braden Montgomery, the freshman right fielder from Mississippi, threw Fuchs out at the plate. More strikeouts for Jerpy, including Adam Crampton right here, the 17th and final strikeout. Alas, his team couldn't get him a run. There's a big K of Fuchs by Dixon with runners at first and third and two down in the eighth inning. And then Cody Huff led off the 10th inning with a double to right. Tommy Troy pinch ran for him. And then Montgomery, who had earlier thrown out Fuchs at the plate, doubles into the right field corner to bring Troy home. And it was a 1-0 lead for Stanford in the 10th. They would go on to win as tomorrow's projected starter, Quinn Matthews, came on to work the 10th inning. And he retired the side in order on nine pitches, two strikeouts. The win goes to Joey Dixon. And Matthews picks up the save. Wade Meckler, four for five, three singles and a double. Jerpy again, a school record, 17 strikeouts. Alex Williams pitched well. A quartet of Stanford pitchers shut down one of the toughest lineups in the country. And again, Braden Montgomery, the hero with his arm and with his bat. Joe Lamuccio getting just his second start this year. The grad chance transfer from Brown, two for four, a couple of singles and a steal. Stanford wins it one nothing. Game two of the series coming up on Saturday at 3 o'clock on Pac-12 Network.